Hi, my name is Hunter Smith. I'm the ag teacher and welding teacher here at Central Freshman Campus. Welcome to our class today. We're doing a lot of different projects, mainly getting ready for the San Angelo Stock Show project show. We have a number of entries in this that we're getting into the complete stages on. We have a group of three boys that are working on a cattle feeder, and we're actually building that for our high school principal. So he'll have something nice to put at his ranch whenever we're done with the contest. We also have a gate that we're building for our facility here at the freshman campus to dress up our place just a little bit more on the exterior. We have another guy that has built a picnic table that he and his family will enjoy once the project show is over and he can take that home. We have a number of barbecue pits. I will probably you know, select the very best barbecue pit that we have and enter that and let that person show that project. On these projects, they are required to make their own hand-drawn drawings to scale. They are required to keep a bill of materials, so it's important for students to know I'm not only going to be able to build something, but I need to know how much it's actually going to cost me. So these things translate into real life on them wanting to do something for their own home someday and the things that you would have to think about. In our program, safety is the essential key, always watching to make sure that everyone is doing things right. These are freshmen, so everything is new to them. And that's our main focus. Once we get that, we're working on basic procedures of all different welding types, cutting, heating, bending, fabrication. So they're getting a good experience here of a well-rounded welding program. Kids generally like working with their hands, so they enjoy the class and generally want to work for you and do well together that way. Confidence is key in building or making anything. Confidence is important in kids' life, so the more things that we can teach them, the better they're educated, the more confidence they have to go throughout their life. It doesn't matter if they're going to be a physician, a lawyer, or an actual welder. Every skill that we teach them is a work and job related skill that is going to be important to them. So I always start them off with a small project. They get a little bit of confidence after doing that. They're ready to handle a larger project then. And then they eventually graduate up to possibly being able to enter a project for show when they get to that type of quality. When students leave my class, I want them to be instilled with some work qualities that any employer is going to look for. And everything that I teach, it's all job related, so I'm trying to teach kids communication skills on how to get along with each other in the workplace, how to get along with a boss, what is expected of them in the workplace, and possibly eventually to be an entrepreneur themselves and own their own business and be able to run that. These are the most important things, how they're treating each other and their work ethic are vital in them becoming productive citizens in our society and I think SAISD is doing a great job of that in our career and technology programs. 